Hey, good afternoon everyone. I hope you are doing fine and shine. This is your friend Prashan and welcome to my YouTube channel, Immigration Dream. So a lot of people have asked me questions on my personal feed that where I am and uh, I'm here guys, I'm not gone anywhere. Uh, it's just that I was not able to make videos because of some reasons and I'm not gonna go into too much details on why I did not do this uh, video for like last one and a half month but there are some personal reasons and there are just other reasons that made me not do the video anyway so first of all everything is good at my end so thanks a lot for your concern uh, the couple of reasons why i actually did not make videos is first of all uh, I, i'm gonna be very honest i was actually really really sad about what happened in October when the visa bulletin moved back to April 2012 for most of the Indian EB2 and EB3. So I was, I'll be honest, I was very sad when that happened and I was not expecting that. Definitely like a change in the trend on from the rest of the world, but I was not expecting that if I'm honest. So really sad about that. So that's one of the reasons why, you know, I thought uh, nothing is going to happen. It made me sad uh, and less hopeful of getting green card uh, in this lifetime. But anyway, the second important reason, most important reason rather, is that, you know, some medical issues with my family. And uh, I'm not going to go too much into detail on what happened exactly. But I think uh, I'll just give you like a high level idea and my learnings from them. So first of all, you know, most of the parents, most of our parents visit America from India to visit us. And a lot of them uh, are retired already and a lot of things happen with them. So um, similar thing happened with one of my parents where they had to had some immediate medical treatment in the US and in the, in the US, uh, medical treatment, as you know, is super expensive. And and even though like we have insurances, uh, I think you have to kind of negotiate on what you have and what you don't have from the insurances. And so I learned a lot of things on about the insurances and how they work and what you should do in case your parents actually face a medical emergency. So I think I'm going to make a separate video just about that. However, uh, just happy to report that everything works out well. Uh, everything is good. Uh, it just took like some of my time and that's why I couldn't uh, dedicate my time for to make videos. But everything is good now. Everything uh, is back to normal and everybody is happy. So happy to report that. But anyway, let's talk about the immigration. So not many things actually happening with respect to immigration. Uh, like the latest visa bulletin is actually, actually not out yet, but I am not expecting major changes, major shift in the direction on the green cards. So I am still expecting that the green card states will not move anywhere because there's just like a lot of intake from rest of the world uh, that is eating into India's chances. So. Let's see what happens. Uh, I'll keep you updated if I see anything exciting. Uh, but, uh, you know, last year was a special year. So I think uh, people who got the green cards, definitely very lucky. And uh, I'm really wishing best for you. Uh, but uh, I think moving forward, uh, I don't honestly think anything major going to happen this year, especially now that you have a divided house and Senate where Senate is probably with uh, Democrats, but the the House is with the Republicans. So unless there is some major negotiations, I don't think that major immigration reforms are going to happen in next two years. I hope I'm wrong, but that's how the trend is in the past. Anyway, so I think, uh, you know, uh, I know that there's like a lot of people are very anxious uh, about not getting green card last year, you know, what's going to happen. I think uh, it's a high time that, you know, you not think about that. Uh, last year was a special year. However, 
uh, I think next few years, if nothing changes in the laws, I think uh, India EB2 and EB3 are going to move at snail space. Uh, and it, it's pretty sad, but the, it is what it is. Uh, so yeah, don't overthink. Uh, I have I got like a lot of questions on my personal feed saying, hey, are they okay with like changing the new jobs? Uh, I mean, my answer is yes. However, looking at what's happening in the economy, looking at what's happening in the layoffs and, you know, more and more layoffs uh, coming from big tech industry, you might want to consider your decision based on your job security versus you know going for a new job uh, where the environment is not that growth friendly so i think uh, just don't think about immigration also think about uh, where you want to go and what industry is in the demand and where um, where you want to do in the next four or five years so take the decisions based on that I don't think a lot of major changes are going to happen with respect to immigration. If anything happens, it will be positive. So I think that's the only thing I can say. But you know, we have waited for like so long. So why not some some more years, correct? Uh, sorry, I'm just uh, sarcastic. But anyway, uh, so uh, I will make a detailed video on how to actually handle the medical conditions in US. What are my learnings uh, from my experience and then what insurance to buy, how to buy, and uh, what to look for. So uh, I'm going to kind of make a, a very separate video about that. So stay tuned for my videos. Now everything is good. Now I'll have time. And so more frequent videos will be coming very soon. So thank you very much for your patience. I really appreciate my subscribers because uh, I just don't know how many of you have asked me personally how I was doing. And that is really heart feeling. So thank you very much for that. Thank you for sticking uh, with this. Uh, so let's uh, you know let's move on in life and you know let's see what we can do next. Uh, I'm gonna make some exciting videos, exciting visa and travel videos, uh, not for just green card but for everybody else. Uh, and uh, so let's uh, you know let's move on. But anyway, you enjoy your uh, you know like holidays, upcoming holidays, Thanksgiving, and then Christmas. Uh, there will be more uh, frequent videos coming from my side. And uh, I hope you guys are doing well in this crazy economic uh, situation. Uh, I feel for anybody who lost their jobs, especially on the H-1B visas, where now you have to have only 60 days to scramble for new opportunity in, um, in a very tough, challenging environment. So I'm gonna also make another video on how to deal with that. Uh, some of the my learnings uh, from the past, from from my friends. Uh, so uh, I will make a separate video on that. Uh, so let's stay tuned for that. But this was just an update video saying everything is good at my end. Uh, everything is back to normal. Uh, and now we'll keep making nice videos again. So thank you very much guys. Uh, enjoy rest of your day. Take care.